we're going to show you a workout using the Opti kettlebell. Michelle's going to do a single arm push press. Select the two kilogram kettlebell, and when you're ready, just copy Michelle. Pick up the kettlebell with an overhand grip, lifting the kettlebell to shoulder height, keeping your palm on your chest and the kettlebell rested on your forearm. From here, you're going to brace your abs and keep your back strong and straight and press the kettlebell straight overhead and bring it back down. And again, up and down, keeping your eyes on the kettlebell when it's overhead. Repeat this motion for 15 to 20 reps on each arm. Do three sets each side and rest 30 seconds in between sets. This will really improve your upper body strength and burn through some calories for you. We're going to show you an exercise called the high pull using the Opti kettlebell. For this exercise, you're going to use a four kilogram weight. With your feet shoulder width apart, take the weight in an overhand grip in one hand, keeping your back straight and lifting it up, bending at the knees. Allow the kettlebell to rest briefly in front of your hips before pulling your elbow high and the kettlebell to your lower chest. Remember to keep this kettlebell close to your body. Take it back down and repeat. And as you pull the weight up, you move your hips slightly forward. Keep your abs braced and don't be afraid to use those hips. Keep going, Michelle, for 10 reps on each arm. Rest for 30 seconds and then complete two sets on each side, improving your strength and strengthening your back. Michelle and I are going to do goblet squats. Goblet squats are a good way to increase your leg strength and improve your balance and stability. We're going to pick up the kettlebell by the bell with both hands. Stand shoulder width apart like Michelle. Drop your hips down, keeping your back straight and your chest up into a squat. Keeping the kettlebell at chest height, sitting back on your heels. Raise back up, driving through your heels, keeping your back straight. And again, keep your knees in line with your toes. Don't push your knees beyond that. Do 20 of these squats, really feel that burn. Working large muscle groups like these help burn lots of calories. Complete four sets, rest in a minute or two in between each set, depending upon your ability. We're working out with these Opti kettlebells and Michelle and I are about to show you how to correctly do a kettlebell swing using a six kilogram kettlebell. Start with a comfortable wide stance, take an overhand grip and lift the kettlebell, keeping your hands between your legs. Remember to keep your back straight and bend from your knees. Keep your arms straight and build momentum by gently rocking your hips backwards and forwards. Using the momentum, swing the kettlebell straight out in front of your body, keeping your abs tight the whole time to strengthen your core. Aim to bring the kettlebell to mid chest or eye height, no higher. This is a brilliant exercise for your cardiovascular system and as it's also weight training, you get maximum calorie burn. Work at intervals of swinging the kettlebell for a minute and resting for a minute for between five to 10 rounds, dependent upon your fitness levels.